after an EHS or a transmission exchange, the transmission or the EHS must be commissioned with star diagnosis. Go to VGS transmission control for a 9-speed transmission and confirm with next. Click on adaptation and then left on commissioning. Then commissioning with a manual adjustment of the new control unit. You'll be guided through all the steps. Carry out the following teaching procedures. The oil level check, the adaptation procedure of the lockup clutch and the standstill adaptation of the transmission. Now read the safety instructions. Take care of the necessary preparations and confirm with next. The programming of the control unit is next. This process takes several minutes. Here too, take note of the tips. When the bar is almost fully loaded, go to the driver's seat because you're prompted to turn the ignition off. Once the ignition is off, the programming continues. When instructed, turn the ignition on again. You can get out of the car. The system completes the programming and automatically goes to the encoding of the control unit. Once the encoding is complete, the conditions for the personalization and activation of the control unit appear. Have all the preparations been made? Then click Next. You get to the sub-item, Programming of the Control Unit, secure the vehicle against rolling and follow the instructions listed. Start the process with Next. Then go back to the driver's seat and when instructed, turn the ignition off. The programming process continues. When instructed, turn the ignition on again. The process continues. When the programming is successful, the corresponding message appears. Confirm by clicking Next and you get to the documentation of the repair order. Print the document if necessary and close the programming procedure. We move to another location. If you have a suitable air extraction system, you can stay in the workshop. We continue with the previous screen, namely by checking the oil level. Note the relevant part of the document, fill the automatic transmission with oil. And make the necessary preparations. Shift into P. Switch off the engine, apply the parking brake. The transmission fluid temperature should be between 34 and 40 degrees Celsius. Confirm with next. The test procedure starts automatically by venting the valves of the multi-disc brake five times. Once the venting is complete, start the engine and run it for 2 seconds above 2,800 RPM. Then, when instructed, shift into neutral. Once you've shifted into N, the valves of the multi-disc clutch are vented automatically. When informed, place the transmission in P. The process takes 180 seconds. Take note of the messages given. Are all the conditions satisfied? Click the Start button. The idle speed will be automatically raised by star diagnosis. Now you can check the oil level in the transmission and adjust if needed. 
Then end the process with the stop button. The actuation is terminated. Then click Next. Star Diagnosis goes back to the menu. Select Adaptation Process of the Lockup Clutch. Communication is established. Then come the following conditions. Is the transmission oil temperature between 20 and 85 degrees and the coolant over 20 degrees Celsius? If so, click Next. Follow the instructions. Once everything has been carried out, the adaptation will start automatically. Once it's finished successfully, on request, shift into P. Then follow the instructions. Switch off the ignition. And shortly afterwards, switch it back on again. The following steps are done automatically. At the end, the implementation of the adaptation was successful. To stop this point, click Next. You return to the menu. Here you select the standstill adaptation. You see the conditions. Again, please pay attention to carrying out the instructions, such as pressing on the brake and starting the engine. Click Next to confirm. The adaptation of the transmission shift system appears. Select all the approved gears and click Next. Make sure that no people are near the vehicle and read the notes carefully. Then Next. If all the conditions are not met, the diagnostic system displays this. If everything is OK, you'll get the prompt, press the accelerator all the way to the end and hold. The process starts. The vehicle begins to shudder. The completed gears are marked with a tick. The adaptation of all gears takes approximately 10 minutes. Subsequently, further instructions will appear. Foot off the accelerator and shift into P. You'll see the results of the adaptation. Confirm with Next. Now it's off to the finish line. Turn the ignition off again and take the key out and wait until the instrument cluster turns off. Click Next. Turn the ignition back on. The connection is established. When you get back into the familiar menu, the commissioning of the transmission is finished.